Hey everybody, welcome to another review. <clears throat> this is one of two that I'm going to do today. I got a couple of requests to um, check out the new Outpost uh, version 7. So I went online, downloaded their uh, Security Suite Pro and installed it. You get 30 days to try it out if you, you know, give it a whirl if you want to check it out. It's uh, fully updated. I installed it stock. Nothing's been changed, you know, just like I like to do all my reviews. Um, we'll wait here for it to update. I have, I think, 10 fairly new links. The one thing you have to remember is if you're going to test this out to see how it works in a virtual machine and something like that, it automatically goes into auto learn mode. So you want to leave auto learn mode and uh, go into standard because if you're in auto learn mode and you try to load malware in, it's going to learn it and think it's okay. Made that mistake the first time I was playing with it. Because I kept learning all the rules for the malware and not detecting anything. I was like, okay. Okay, so let's get started here. I don't know exactly how many of these are going to work. I've been playing with them today already. Okay, it seems like that one doesn't want to do anything for me anymore. Looks like Internet Explorer caught that one. We'll see how Outpost does. Okay, so uh, attempting application attempt attempting to modify another application's memory. Uh, it's trying to modify SVC host. We will block. Uh, you also have a smart advisor thing here, where it kind of gives you advice on what you should do. Um, which is kind of nice, but we'll block and terminate. Looks like that one might have got caught by... Oh, yep, there you go. I found uh, malware, so we will remove it. I think it caught that one, too. Yep. Computer does seem a little bit slower, um, so it is having some impact on performance. Okay, here we go. Once again, attempting to modify another application's memory. We put black and terminate. And that one, that first one didn't work. We'll just keep going. And that one didn't work. last one here. Yeah, 
and I think that one got caught as malware. So let's see if we have anything running in memory. Looks like we do have something running. And it's taken up a ton of CPU. See right there, 27%. So I'm going to kill that process. Yeah. I'm going to try to kill that process. There it is. Okay. And now I am going to, you can see how much uh, memory usage we have. That's uh, a process from Outpost. Got 112 megs right there. There's another process for seven, about seven or eight. So definitely uses a lot of memory. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to scan for malware. I'm going to do a full system scan, and I'll be back when this is done. Okay, so finished scanning here, and it didn't find anything. So now I'm going to go get my uh, tools and run CCleaner first, before I forget and then run Malwarebytes. So I'll be back after Malwarebytes is done scanning. Okay, so uh, Malwarebytes finished scanning and it didn't find anything, so that's good. And last, I'm going to do a scan with Hitman Pro here. And we'll see if it finds anything. I wonder if we'll find that uh, file that we saw running in RAM that I had to kill because it was using uh, CPU time. So, I'll be back when this is done. Okay, so, um, Hitman Pro finished scanning, and it did find a Trojan. Um, it's not the same one we saw running in RAM. That one's probably fairly new and hasn't been detected by either Hitman or Malwarebytes. Um, be right back. The phone's ringing. Alright, so, um, final decision on Outpost. Well, it let this one through, and it let that other one that was in RAM through. So, it's hard to make a decision right now. Um, it's a decent uh, firewall, but I'm just not sure about their security suite. They definitely need to work on uh, signatures, and um, they really need to work on RAM usage and how light it is on the... Uh, the system because I can definitely feel a lag. Other than that, it uh, looks like they're stepping in the right direction. Uh, I like the uh, overall feel of the, the suite here. Fairly easy to uh, to use and uh, you know looks modern. So other than that, uh, that's it for this review. I'll uh, let you guys go, and uh, I'll do another one later this afternoon. Take care.